What's happening, folks? Gerald here, aka J490, coming at you with another reaction, another Whitney reaction, but welcoming to the channel the legendary Natalie Cole. And this is important, and this is kind of different because I'm this is a two for one special. So I'm doing both of the duets that Whitney and Natalie did on the 1990 show that um, Natalie Cole hosted, where she had Whitney Houston on Big Break. And those songs are I Say a Little Prayer for You and Bridge Over Troubled Water. And this is this is different because when it comes to those two, I am extremely familiar with the um, Whitney and Natalie. I say a little prayer for you um, performance. So my, I have it downloaded. I have well, I have the audio up on my stuff and on playlist, and all the time I could do a complete lip sync to that. I won't, <laughs> not on here, not for this. But um, it is probably one of my favorite duets and i know that whitney and natalie i think they have a few different duets and all that but let me say this though just from my thoughts on i say a little prayer for you um to me whitney houston has done duets with phenomenal singers of so many different generations and genres um the pioneers before her the her peers she's done duets with her peers and she's done duets with the younger generations who came after her too and of all of the female singers i could think of there are two who come to mind who i would say that vocally are like her voice sisters like think about the clark sisters how and it, it's a sibling thing where it's why they said you know siblings kind of have the best um harmony is because you know Kind of the same stuff. But um, think of the Clark sisters. You can hear that fa family sound in their voice. And then in the group where they're not siblings, but I kind of thought they were growing up because of what I would say is a family style, style or sound in the voice. The members of En Vogue, the original members more so, but um, En Vogue, they have a thing where they sound like they have sister voices without being sisters. And for me, personally, Natalie Cole... CC Winans, they are Whitney Houston's sister voices. Like when their voices are together, it's not a find where you fit. It's not a the blend isn't polarizing. They almost melt together. And I just I realized that when I first heard I'll say a little prayer for you. And I wish that I could have done a first reaction to that like five years ago when I first heard that but I have not heard their duet of bridge over troubled water and so that's gonna be the new part but I say a little prayer for you that's just gonna be the fun that's gonna be the fun I want to see both and so instead of two separate videos we're gonna do because hey it was one episode of one show so we're gonna make this one thing too before I get to it, I need you guys to go ahead and subscribe and ring the bell for notifications and now without further ado all that damn talking this is Whitney Houston and Natalie Cole with I say a little prayer for you and bridge over troubled water she's already had seven number one singles I can only be talking about one person please welcome the Grammy award-winning superstar my baby sister Miss Whitney Houston hey. I love their band this evening. We're going to sing a song that neither one of us has ever done before, an old Aretha Franklin classic. Mm. Okay? Okay. You ready? I'm ready. You can clap along. <laughs> Natalie. Come on. 
Come on, Whitney. Natalie. Come on, Whit. So clean. So clean. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Come on. Break it down. Hey. Natalie. Come on.
you better get out of here. Y'all, it's the ad libs for me, for real. That was so good. That was amazing. Oh my god. It um I left the name out. I left the name out of it's a quad. It Whitney 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 could Whitney could have had her own in vogue of the quad of singers. For me, Whitney's vocal sisters, I got it right now. The vocal sisters are um Whitney, Natalie Cole, Mickey Howard, and Cece Winans. Those four voices to me lend them have something that reminds me of each other and where it's like if I could hear all four of them on the same stage singing the same song or if we could have because we don't have we don't have rest in peace Whitney and Natalie but if we if there was a time in like 1990 with those four voices on one stage I think we would have been I I don't I think the room would have collapsed I don't know if the world could have taken that but those are the four voices anyway anyway that I'm going to be ripping that. I will know the ad-libs for that Bridge Over Troubled Water 2. I, I still got to do the Whitney and Cece version as well. So I have that to look forward to as well. And that that was just... Oh, man, rest in peace. Nat Natalie, to me, is very underrated. I feel like Natalie only gets written off for This Will Be and, and her duet Unforgettable with... Um, her late father, Nat King Cole, the legendary pioneering Nat King, Nat King Cole. And I feel like Natalie only gets mostly mentioned and recognized for those two songs. But no, again, I know Natalie to be that, <laughs> to be one of the best voices of our time. And beyond that, she had good albums. She had really good albums. And I'm going to be doing a lot of her on the channel because I, if she's another artist I'm more familiar with songs even a lot of songs i didn't i don't know the name of i'm more familiar with her voice than the performances and the, the, i know that there's some music videos too so in the comments very important natalie cole recommendations whitney too but whitney's a given y'all gonna see this is what the third whitney video this month come on now <laughs> whitney's a given but natalie what tell me about your favorite natalie cole songs your favorite natalie cole performances i want to see those there's been very few natalie cole performances that i've seen beyond <laughs> like to say a little prayer for you and I don't, I don't know if I've seen a performance of this. I've seen her do this will, this will be in the 2000s. You know, my intro to that song was the Parent Trap. But anyway, <laughs> um, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this reaction. I very much enjoyed making this reaction. So I don't care if you did. <laughs> no, I can't. I'm kidding. I do care. I do care. And I hope you did. If you did, please go ahead and like and subscribe and ring the bell for notifications. Um, if you'd like to share this on social media, I'd appreciate that. If you'd like to follow me on social media, that's in the description below. And if you'd like to tip me, sponsor a request, donate, just plain donate, that's in the description as well. Maybe, hopefully, this will get a hard thing. We'll see. And um, you can also join my Patreon. On Patreon, you're going to get benefits like um, early access to reactions and videos like these and Patreon only videos and reactions like these. And then beyond everything else, just thank you guys so much for even pressing play on this video. It all means a lot. It all goes a long way. And please take care of yourselves and each other. Dang that I want it.